Did you know this fact about the television show? The Muppet Show Season 4 currently only has one copy produced, and it is being held hostage by Disney Pixar Marvel Lucasfilm Fox Studios executives. If you have the audacity to ask a Disney Pixar Marvel Lucasfilm Fox Studios employee to do any of the following, produce more copies of the DVD, sell you the only copy of the DVD, or give you an update on the eventual release of the DVD, they will come to your house and silently, legally kill you in your sleep within 5 to 9 business days. Did you know this fact about the real life? For my third grade talent show, I did a guitar cover of Kermit the Frog's Rainbow Connection. It was beautiful and I won second place, though oddly enough, I was the only one who entered. Did you know this fact about the video game? Spy Muppets License to Croak is notoriously known as one of the few M-rated games on the Game Boy Advance system. Perhaps this is a reference to one of the earliest Muppet Show pilots titled Sex and Violence, as this game is absolutely stuffed with just that. Whenever Kermit defeats an enemy in this game, there is a gory display akin to the Mortal Kombat franchise. One of the more well-known animations from this game involves Kermit pulling out a grenade out of his rectum, igniting it, and then painfully cracking the jaw of his foe and shoving the grenade down their throat. Upon explosion, the enemy's guts will splat against the screen, with every enemy in the game having a unique display of guts and a name associated with them. Most animators and game developers who have observed this game presume that most of the game's development time was spent on this attention to detail. Needless to say, this inclusion outraged Muppet fans and parents alike, as most people in the know about the Muppets realize that Kermit would absolutely never pull a grenade out of his rear, but rather somewhere much safer, such as his trademark fanny pack that he's always seen wearing, or, you know, just a pocket or something. This quickly got the game recalled and remade from the ground up. In the process of being remade, the game strangely had its adult content sanitized and it became a much safer, much more age-appropriate game, dropping down from an M rating to a mere T rating. Did you know this fact about the video game? The 2003 video game Muppets Party Cruise was originally under the development title Muppets Cruise – Getting Hot on the Yacht. In a lackluster interview with the now-defunct gaming magazine, screenshots of the game suggested gameplay more in line with the provocative video game series known as Dead or Alive Extreme. If I had to guess, I would say this likely changed due to the previous controversy surrounding Spy Muppets licensed to Croak earlier that year, which probably prompted the developers to quickly edit the game into a more all-ages experience. This led to a massive outcry from fans proclaiming censorship and demanding to see more sexy Muppets. Did you know this fact about the video games? The Muppets Movie Adventures is an exclusive game for the PlayStation Vita and was published by Sony Computer Entertainment. Previously, it was the second highest grossing title for the PlayStation Vita only behind the infamous Persona 4 Golden, a sequel to Persona 5 that was considered a letdown by fans all over the world. However, after Sony announced the closure of the PlayStation Vita store in April 2021, many Muppet fans and gamers alike rushed to buy the game as quickly as they could, and as of April 25th, 2021, The Muppets Movie Adventures is now the highest grossing PlayStation Vita videos game. Did you know this fact about the video game? Muppets Most Wanted, the video game, was ironically one of the least wanted games of all time. This was according to the legally mandatory 2014 American Gamer Census. However, in the year 2021, the game has quickly received a cult classic following. This sudden spark in interest is likely due to the discovery of a level in the game. The level in question letting you play as Kermit the Frog's evil counterpart Constantine, while getting to delightfully enter the character resembling Ricky Gervais in many violent ways, similar to how the Wolfenstein series lets you joyfully brutalize Nazis. This led to a shortage of game copies, prompting the developers to release the game digitally and port it to the Google Stadia. Did you know this fact about the movies? 
and Ralph Breaks the Internet, Wreck-It Ralph Part 2, there is a massive, like seriously big giant Kermit the Frog head alongside other iconic Disney, Pixar, Marvel, Lucasfilm, Fox Studio owned properties. This implies the movie takes place in an alternate reality where Disney, Pixar, Marvel, Lucasfilm, Fox Studios values the Muppets as a viable and beloved franchise, while they clearly do not in this reality. Did you know this fact about the commercials? If you don't like Wilkins coffee, you're not allowed to be alive. I'm, I'm sorry, I, I don't make the rules. You, you might be asking what Wilkins coffee even is, but unfortunately, if you're asking that question, it's, it's a little too late, buddy. Unfortunately, dear viewer, this is it for you. Wilkins is already on his way over. There is like no hope left for you. And even if I wanted to, I could sadly do nothing if you want any chance at salvation, please, please do whatever you can to get your hands on some Wilkins. It's no longer being made, but it's the only way. Quick, before he gets you. Oh, oh, and just, just for good measure. Uh, another thing that might help is to keep watching more Did You Know This Fact About videos and make sure to dislike and unsubscribe from this channel in order to hide any evidence of ever having been here. There might be hope for you, but I doubt it. I, I really, truthfully, I just doubt it. I, I could have saved you if I acted sooner, but I, I, I think it's I think it's too late. Don't don't close your eyes. If you do, then you, you'll, you'll you'll see him, and then it'll be too late. <laughs>